the time of Easter is a time to invite Jesus into our lives. We have already entered into the season of Easter. In today's gospel, two disciples were going away from Jerusalem to Emmaus after the tragic events that occurred there. And as they were going, they were discussing that how Jesus presented himself as their only hope. He was the one who was supposed to redeem them from all their miseries. And we could understand in their uh, conversation how much desperate they were. Their spirits were down. They had a lot of hopelessness within them. Now, Jesus on the way joined them, though they did not recognize them. He asked them what happened. And they told about whatever happened in Jerusalem. And even while narrating that, they were giving him that they were very hopeless. And slowly Jesus began to explain to them the scriptures. And on the way, they were able to break the bread with him. And their eyes were opened. Not only their eyes were opened, they recognized that when Jesus was explaining to them the scriptures, their spirits were lifted up. My dear brothers and sisters, the time of Easter is a time to invite Jesus into our lives. Let us invite him to walk with us so that he may be able to address our troubles, our struggles, our disappointments, our dilemmas in our life. He can walk through our dilemmas, our persisting troubles, and he is able to do it. Let us invite that everlasting presence of the risen Lord, because these disciples realized that he is not dead, he is risen and with them, Emmanuel. Let us invite that everlasting presence of Christ into our own lives so that he can take us away from the experiences of tomb and hopelessness. <laughs>